Professor Liu is going to show you how to do number three. So this program is going to prompt the user to enter a length, a width, and calculate the area and perimeter. So let's run this program right now. So I build it. Uh, I have to rebuild it. And I start without debugging. So let me just pull easy number, like 5, like a 10, 50, 30. Okay. But this is not ideal. We have to check to use function. So number one, we are going to do this right now. First, uh, we say we want to um, use this call calculate area and calculate perimeter. Is that okay? So uh, I am going to uh, calculate area, calculate perimeter. So here, <clears throat> right here, let me start from very beginning. First, I want to get input. All right. So how many input do I have right now? Anybody? Two. Yeah. So two input. I always cannot use function return. The function re the uh, return value. A function return value, they can only return one. So obviously we cannot do that. So I'm going to say void get input. Then I'm going to do this right now. Double and I'm going to do M percent L E N and double and M percent W I D. Okay. So now I got input value right here. Then I am going to uh, calculate that uh, get your thing right here. So I am going to get here control X and control V right here. Now I'm going to input, I'm going to use a different uh, uh, function to get this. But different function is called LEN, so I'm going to delete here. <clears throat> and I'm going to use use WID. The reason I do this is I using M percent. So the, the the length and the LEN actually is using the same memory location. Your computer programming will call that alias. You will think length and LEN is actually a same variable because they share the same memory location. All right. So whatever you get here it's equal whatever you get here okay now we are going to do this we are going to get area and perimeter okay so we're going to do this is uh calculate and we're going to say uh double uh calculate area and then when i calculate area i need length i need width okay then I am coming to here to get my uh, <coughs> create uh, thing right here. So I'm going to create here. So actually I create it here is length times width. All right. So I calculate area. Then of here area I'm not going to calculate here anymore I'm going to use CAL area and I'm going to pass length and width inside here all right so I finished that instead of a actual uh, uh, a function inside the main that's low security we want to put the high security in function call then always we need another one is perimeter so we say double calculate uh i should put calc sorry uh, uh, perimeter all right and i have the something same all right so and when I need to calculate this, I do the exactly the same thing. And I'm just going to return is 
uh, <clears throat> two times len plus wid. All right, I will return that. Okay, so the perimeter we're not going to do the uh, calculation here because you put your calculation in the main program and it's not secure enough because it's open to public. It's very easy to somebody make a mistake, then you will destroy your program. So usually here has only function call. Understand? So calculate uh, CAL uh, perimeter. All right. So you're going to pass a length and you're going to pass width inside here. All right. So we finished that right now. Then we're going to display, right? So when you display, and uh, you, you you just display area and perimeter, right? So you say uh, void display and uh, double uh, a double p, okay? About that. All right. Then we just going to uh, create our definition right here. So once I close it because it's too fuzzy and I come right here to display, I'm just going to copy the thing here. All right, but we don't call it area because right now, obviously I pass A to you, I pass P to you, you're going to use that. All right. Uh, the area is uh, uh, all right so we are going to put right here all right and here you're going to display all right and uh, you're going to put area and perimeter all right then we finish. So here again, uh, uh, by the way, this we, we have to delete it too because here we are going to say get input. Is that right? And here you're going to have a uh, length and you're going to have width. Now we complete the modification. Once modification is done, you don't have the code actually right in the main because main is open to public. All right, so if you write a code right here, you create a big potential, someone will modify your program. So make your program uh, later be modified and maybe uh, um, cause problems. So we usually want to have function call only. So let's build this program right now and start without debugging. All right, so I do five and I do 10. Same thing, the 50, 30, there's no problem at all right now. All right, so Professor Liu is going to continue modify this. The reason is if you get area, you want need function. You get perimeter, you also get one function. Why don't we just get one function to get both area and perimeter? So again, we want something called area perimeter. So I'm going to come like here and I'm it because it has to be returned both area and perimeter. It has to be void function. Okay. So I'm going to get area and perimeter. It's going to do two things per re meter. It's going to do two things. But you are going to input length. That's the same thing. You're going to have input width. All right. But when you return, when you return, you're going to return LEN and you're going to return WID. You want to use the address. You want to use the address. Okay.
All right. Oh, we. Uh, sorry. This should be wrong. Should be A area and P for perimeter. Sorry. Okay. I write it wrong. So area perimeter. It's okay. So it's going to be like that way. So I'm coming right here uh, to create my definition right now, and I go to my shortcut. Okay. The shortcut. Right. <clears throat> Sometimes the shortcut is painful. Now I click this short, shortcut icon to create my bed, uh, my uh, uh, definition. So this will be close here, and I'm just going to write down here. Okay, uh, yeah. right here. Okay, so this will be a equal uh, like the control C. It's okay, and uh, P equal and this will be like that Control Z Control V Alright, so now I finish that I actually can delete these two right now Alright, I'm just going to use one I'm just going to use one, okay So I delete both of these Delete both of these Alright and and the main i also need to fix right now i'm not going to do like this it's okay i am just going to say uh uh calculate uh area perimeter and i am going to pass length and width into it and i'm waiting for you return area and perimeter back to me all right and i display that so i modify this program to be more precise just use one function to do the to replace two function and let me run to see if i have that uh received the exactly same result so i do this right now i do the same thing five and ten i got the exactly the same thing but the same thing the uh, same uh, result, I use less function to do it. To in order to do that, to in order to do that, I use a void function uh, to have two input and two output. And because I need a two output, so I cannot use function return value. I need to use void function. I hope you like this program.